conversation longer than 30 minutes because I feel like every time I'm talking, I'm like on the verge of tears and I don't want to have to explain to strangers why I'm crying. Yeah. That nigga cheated on her in her house. He no longer cared about her no more. He didn't give a fuck about her no more. He didn't care about getting caught. He was just like, fuck it. If it happened, it happened. You got with a real hot girl and wasn't expecting real hot girl. Did Partisan Fontaine cheat on Megan? So Megan made her long-awaited return to making music after she dropped a song titled Cobra, but the message in the music overshadowed the news of her return. This is because in the song, Megan called out her ex-boyfriend Partisan Fontaine for cheating on her while they were still together, and it looked like Partisan cheating on her was the reason for her being absent for so long. So while we thought Megan and Party's relationship was gonna last together because of the chemistry they had and how well they looked after each other, it seemed like there were lots of things happening behind the scenes which fans did not know about. So, sometime this year, Megan shocked everyone when she was spotted with soccer star Romeo Lukaku, and fans were left wondering what happened between her and Partisan. For those who didn't know about Megan and Partisan, let me give you a little refresher. Megan and Partisan met while they were working on Megan's award-winning song Savage, and they started dating in late 2020. In February 2021, Megan confirmed the relationship on Instagram Live, but it didn't take long before rumors started swirling around that they had broken up. Rumors started going around that Partisan called off the relationship because Megan had an alcohol problem and she tended to get really violent towards Partisan whenever she got drunk. Party debunked the rumors saying, Stop this cap, nobody putting hands on anybody, at least not in that way. Been seeing the breakup rumors and was letting y'all's imaginations run but y'all getting too crazy. Ain't give anyone a story so they made one. We have really been on it double time. Weeks after Partisan dismissed the initial breakup rumors, new rumors of the separation began going around again. These rumors seem to be too persistent to not be true. However, sources close to the couple eventually confirmed that the breakup rumors were true. They did go through a breakup, but they often managed to reconcile and Megan's drinking habit played a role in their breakup. What's fascinating here is that people often blamed Megan for the breakups, and some fans made it look like Party was doing her a favor by being in a relationship with her because Megan has some kind of bad PR when it comes to being with some men. Lots of rappers have previously claimed that they have been with Megan or they know someone who has been with her. Y'all remember when Blue this was on the Jason Lee show where he revealed that he got some mouth action from Megan, and there was the baby who dropped a song titled Boogeyman, and he revealed he did some crazy things with Megan Thee Stallion. He said, The day before she said that Tory Lane f***ed her, I was effing on Megan Thee Stallion. Waited to say that ish on my next album. Hit it the day before too. But I kept it player. I ain't say nothing about it. Had a pretty boy boyfriend tweeting me, ready to die about the be like a coward. I told you men don't play. Now you're gonna have to handle me. There have been other rappers who also sang about being with Megan, but they were exposed for being liars. The whole rapping about being with Megan started way before she and Partisan started dating, so he's got an idea. But well, y'all know it's Hollywood and everything gets blown out of proportion. But things got really messy during the Megan and Tori Lane's trial when Tori's lawyers went about revealing how Megan and Tori used to sleep around. But Partisan didn't care about all of this and dropped a word of support for Megan. He wrote, To any women, especially ones of color that have suffered an injustice, I feel for you. When you do find the courage to speak up, it seems you will be ridiculed. Your credibility will be questioned. Your entire past will be held under a magnifying glass. In an instant, you can go from victim to defendant in the eyes of the public. Partisan won fans over after he stuck and supported Megan throughout the Tory Lane's trial after all he heard in court from Tory Lane's lawyers. Fans believed he could have simply called off the relationship because of what he heard in court was shocking, but then him deciding to stay with Megan really meant that he loved her. Even though Partisan appeared composed in court and issued a statement, Megan revealed that he had confided in her, expressing his discomfort when Tori's lawyers discussed her involvement with Tori. Partisan felt embarrassed, and Megan shared, I feel disgusted and dirty. My own partner is ashamed. I can't even find happiness. As the saying goes, all good things eventually come to an end. In this case, Megan and Partisan ended their relationship, and many fans believed that Megan was the cause of the breakup, and it was possibly because of the embarrassment he felt during the Tory Lane's trial. Well, it turned out that fans were wrong, and Megan was not the problem in the relationship after all, because after months of silence, Megan and decided to open up about her breakup with Partisan. She addressed her breakup with Partisan in her new song titled Cobra, where she talked about Partisan cheating on her. She sang, pulled up, caught him cheating, getting intimate in the same place I sleep in. 
Lord, give me a break. I can't handle much more of this. It gets worse when you realize Partisan could have chipped in a word for Megan when she got dragged by fans for being the reason why the relationship ended. He could have simply debunked the cheating rumors and saved Megan the embarrassment, but he chose to play silent. Now it has backfired because Megan talking about her Partisan cheated on her in a new song made fans storm his Instagram page and they left some not so nice comments, which made him limit the comment section. Well, fans dragged Partisan. They said, Partisan Fontaine is so effed up. He supported Megan publicly through the aftermath of her shooting, literally argued with the shooter online, knew what she was going through behind closed doors and all her feelings and shit, and that he cheated. He the worst kind of man, bitch me. Partisan Fontaine gave Megan the karma she needed for sleeping with her best friend man. The irony is she's crying about being cheated on. And Partisan cheating on Megan while she was going through such a hard time in her life is insane. How do you kick someone you love when they're down? Child, this really is a hot mess. And he is so wrong for treating Megan like that. But what do y'all think about Megan exposing party like this? Drop your thoughts in the comments, then check out this next video.